This house always has sandbags stacked up and ready to go. Replacing them, refilling them, getting new ones. Owner Gilbert Castillo says it was just a few months after moving in when the 2010 monsoon hit his property hard. This wall came up. It told me when the water came, it took this down. This totally came down. Castillo knew the 49er Country Club area sits along the Tanca Verde Creek and that he was in a flood zone. But I didn't realize it was the lowest spot pretty much here in 49ers. Rushing water trapped him inside his new house for hours. He shared pictures of the mud and debris, saying the damage was estimated at around $60,000. Walls came down, my fencing came down outside in the back, pool got filled with mud, but nothing outside the house is covered with a flood insurance policy. Monsoon has always caused varying levels of flooding throughout the Tucson area. There was sand actually made available in the parking lot of High Corbett Field, and so people were filling bags of sand and taking it to their places. Some of the more troublesome spots have even seen some improvements in recent years. The Palo Verde neighborhood struggled for years with monsoon flooding, but neighbors in this area say that this drainage basin is doing its job, keeping the water off the roadways. But parts of the 49er area continue to lie in a FEMA flood zone. The Pima County Regional Flood Control District says flood insurance is recommended, even for the homes just outside where insurance is mandatory. Found out the hard way how much it didn't cover. Despite the risks, Castillo says he still can't help looking forward to monsoon every year. My trees here, uh, two years ago, they were dying out here just from lack of water. So we do need it. We do realize it. So yeah, I still look forward to it. So, but it, we're always on any heavy rainstorm. We get a little bit apprehensive. Brian Brennan, KGUN 9 on your side.